Taurine, what is it? Taurine is a derivative of an amino acid. This means you can get it from food sources as well. It can be made in the body from other amino acids. The best sources of taurine are through food from meat and fish, specifically Alaskan salmon, mackerel, lamb, and liver that have the highest amount of taurine per kilogram. Some of you may already know, taurine is also a common ingredient in energy drinks such as Red Bull. Taurine moves throughout the body where it gets absorbed from the small intestine and it's excreted in the kidneys and the large intestine. It also has antioxidant effects in the brain, liver, eyes, muscles, and heart. Some of you may have heard about taurine in the media with its potential health consequences in energy drinks, but is it all bad? Studies have shown that taurine may decrease blood pressure, lowering the risk of hypertension. It has been suggested that taurine may help reduce the constriction of arteries and reduce arterial pressure. Another study looked at patients and their cholesterol levels. The researchers gave taurine in addition to their regular treatment and saw a decline in the patient's clinical symptoms. Taurine assisted the liver in reducing the amount of cholesterol in their blood. Another group looked at hamsters and have suggested that taurine may increase calcium in the heart, allowing it to work better. This was done after a clinical trial in humans where researchers looked at patients with congestive heart failure. Unfortunately, that study showed no significant changes to their clinical symptoms. There has been some evidence to suggest that taurine has a role in improving insulin resistance in people with type 2 diabetes and type 2 diabetes complications. It does this by reducing inflammation throughout the body, as well as preventing the breakdown of the pancreas, which is the insulin-secreting organ. Finally, taurine is essential to muscle function and exercise. It has been shown to improve performance, endurance, and decrease muscle damage. Now, what about energy drinks? Well, the biggest health concern with energy drinks is the interaction of all of the compounds, such as taurine, sugar, and caffeine. Taurine interacting with caffeine is the biggest health concern. Most energy drinks are not regulated, and therefore the amount of caffeine can vary from 50 mg to 505. Also, all of the health benefits seen with taurine are at levels much higher than found in energy drinks. Studies looked at anywhere between 2 to 6 grams of taurine per day, whereas the typical energy drink has 1 gram. So what does this mean for taurine? Well, like most compounds and nutrients, it's best in whole foods, and it may not be taurine itself that's a culprit for negative health effects, but likely the interaction with other compounds.